Hello, here's your Waltham. Beautiful uh, 16 jewel movement. Uh, gorgeous watch uh, with the Fahey's Montauk case. She's nice and polished right now. So what I want to tell you first, uh, so let's go over the care and winding and uh, setting the hands. And, uh, and this thing is on its, this thing, this Waltham's on its way to Australia, so, which is very cool. So, uh, Hopefully she makes in one piece. I think she will. Been done many times on my end. Various people. So uh, what I want to tell you is so care. Um, it's not a waterproof watch. So you want to avoid wearing it in the rain. Or anything where there's fluid could get into. Uh, through the case. Through the crown. Um, try to avoid that. And avoid leave, leaving it in places where there's direct sunlight. Just beating on it all day or something like that. Uh, for hours. That's not good for it. So. Avoid that, and uh, on these gold fill cases, on this case, when it starts to dull up, so it's going to change color uh, a little bit, um, just get a rouge cloth, uh, R-O-U-G-E, rouge cloth, and just wipe it down all over the glass and everything else like that, and, and just and just wipe it off with a clean cloth, and uh, she'll, she'll stay like this forever. So let's go over the uh, winding first. I, I don't think this will take a full wind, so... Uh, on unwinding, we're not going to go back and forth like a modern watch. We're just going to wind in the one direction or clockwise direction. So let's do that now. And a slight pressure in on the crown. Okay, so. Full wind, but it's about 12 of these. So just take your time on the winding. Get a good grip on it. And that only took like half a wind. So. There you go. And for some reason, if you get it in Australia and you don't see the second hand ticking right away when you when you wind it, just give it a little because of the trip. I'm not sure how many airports or machines it, uh, that it goes through to check what it is in the box. So just give it a little little coffee swirl. I call it a coffee swirl. And she should fire right up. Um, let's see. Other than that, let's see. Going to go ahead now and set the time. Um, so instead of a pull on the crown, you're doing a pinch behind the crown, just pinch it out. Okay. It's good solid back and forth. And this way the keyless works and the stem and sleeve set up lasts for a very long time. Push it in one more time. So pinch out on the crown. And when you move the hands, uh, move them in the clockwise or forward direction. This is all for the good of the movement. Like a pocket watch. This is exactly, it has the same setup, the stem crown and everything on it as a pocket watch. There you go. And set the time and push in the crown. Enjoy it and wear it every day. And uh, I can't wait till it gets to you. Thank you.